What's up, ladies and gents? Getting some of my road work in for the evening. You know, something interesting, I've seen a few folks talking about this of late. A lot of the time, you don't see grapplers, jiu-jitsu players, wrestlers, what have you, put all that much focus on road work. Well, some do, but it's not as ubiquitous a part of the culture. The fact is that kickboxers, boxers, and MMA fighters tend to be much more focused on road work as part of their training. Now, the reason that I put so much focus on road work as part of my training certainly is going to partially stem from my background and my roots in MMA and kickboxing, but I continue to put a large focus on it, even though I'm mostly focused now on grappling. A couple reasons for that. Most of you that follow me know if there is one thing that I pride myself on as a competitor, one thing that I pride myself on uh, as a grappler, it is my cardio, it is my pace. There are plenty of more talented, more skillful competitors out there. I'm chasing them, but I'm not there yet. But my goal for close to 15 years now is to make sure that I can set a pace that nobody can match that nobody can set a pace that I can't match. And is road work the only reason or the only way that I accomplish that? Definitely not. But it's a piece of it. It's not enough by itself. But for me, it builds that baseline, that foundation that my heart rate will always return to, that I'm used to the mental grind, the mental suck of just Put one foot in front of the other, one foot in front of the other. And especially when, as you can see, I am running with one or both of my kids and I'm pushing a big heavy stroller, which makes it that much more challenging and that much more inefficient. But for my purposes, that's a good thing. Like I've talked about before, that's why the hotter the better, as far as I'm concerned, because I'm not trying to set a good time. I'm trying to push myself through the crappiest experience possible. And I'll be honest with you, I don't like running, but I do a lot of it because I like winning. And that's what works for me. I'm not saying that if you don't put a ton of time into road work that you're not going to be successful, but like I said, that is something that has been an important piece of my preparation and my training, both physically and mentally. Of course, there's other ways to push it uh, in terms of getting your cardio work in, whether it's sprints, circuits, um, supersets lots of hard rolls, a million ways to accomplish it. So whatever works for you, do it with all your might. Let me know in the comments what your preference is after you finish your training. See you later, guys.